Hey guys, it's Gary Dean, DetailJuice.com. As you can see, I am on the intercoastal in St. Petersburg, Florida today on Treasure Island. Super stoked to be here. Um, I'm about to start working on a, a really awesome buddy of mine that I've had for, I don't know, almost 12 years now. Uh, he's a client, he's an entrepreneur, super awesome guy. I really love helping this guy out just because we have lots of business chats and all of that, but to uh, cut to the chase, we have a 21 foot 212X Yamaha. Yes, it needs a detail. We're gonna work on that as well. Uh, today, I'm gonna be installing my Infinity Liner. It's a 2K, two-part urethane spray-in liner material. Uh, it was designed for the marine industry, which is why we're gonna do it on the floor of this boat today. And uh, so the whole floor is going to be lined. Uh, we are going to remove these traction mats that are failing and looking all kinds of gross. Uh, so we're gonna remove the, the mats from all these sections, uh, which is going to be an interesting situation. And I also have to replace one of these uh, latches because, uh, well, they're both broken uh, and when I went to open that one, it literally snapped the handle off. So we have another one. I'm gonna do my best to get this open and get the clean out port area uh, straight before I go into removing all these mats. So before you know it, this will be infinity lined and it will look awesome. And uh, we'll be dragging all our crap back here and uh, onto the dock. But look at this. This is what I love about my job being on the water all right first step is removing these mats and replacing uh one of the uh latches and then we'll be starting to prep in the, on the interior I'll probably put tony in on prep while i'm removing mats or maybe we'll do it both i don't know we're going to come up with a plan and i'll let you know what that plan is when we come back so we'll be right back all right guys we got a little bit of progress I am uh, removing the mats from there. I got Tony on the inside cleaning and sanding and taping and all the things. So I've got a lot of work left to do. Probably a couple more hours on this, then we'll get to spraying uh, and then uh, she'll be good to go. So I'm using a 3M rubber wheel with the drill, uh, which not a huge fan of the setup. Uh, but it is working. I'm cutting most of it off first. Then I'm going back with the wheel and getting the excess. I did this little pad here. I took that off the other side and you see where I've done there. I also put the new latch uh, in. So that's a little bit of progress. So we'll be back in just a bit uh, so I can show you some real progress. Another interesting sea creature. I have seen these before looks like a piece of ink but he comes up and goes down up and down I wonder if that's a uh, air breathing monster I have to figure out what exactly that is see the head comes out of the water weird interesting looking situation some kind of sea slug or something quite majestic in the water babe weird looking thing yep we're still out here still working how's it going how's it going mama the lovely the lovely Tony is in the uh, boat handling some tape while I'm removing the mats and I'm watching uh, the crazy sea creatures as they go by all right guys sorry i am already spraying i'm actually mixing up a new batch now to uh spray but i got everything taped off tony did a great job on the inside and i've sprayed one bottle so far of infinity liner um i gotta do this rear deck area and then finish up the inside so i'm gonna go ahead and i got my uh little compressor set up out here i'm gonna go ahead and get this uh next bottle all sprayed in and get her done. I'll bring you back when I've got some more done. 
All right, so here's the view from the back. You can see we went around all of the, pretty much everything. It looks just super awesome, very professional. And uh, that's what my clients expect from me and that's exactly what they get. You can see that it matches pretty good, but the cool part is I feel like it looks even better because you can tell the difference in the whites between the gel coat and the actual um, liner. So, looks great. All right, here's the rear lounge deck. Uh, if you guys noticed before, I still have to put the cup holders back in there over there. If you noticed before, um, th there were uh, traction uh, EVA foam traction mats like C-Deck, but it's the Yamaha version. Uh, they were there and then all over here. There was a piece there. This was covered and then the piece there and there were two pieces down there. And you can see how awesome they look with just the liner on it. I did replace that. Uh, that one's broken, but looks pretty good. All right, I'm gonna hop out and I'll shoot the uh, outro. All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, here's the rear lounge deck, if you will. Looking awesome. Um, I only lined where the mats were. And on the interior, I only lined where the non-skid is. So that is Infinity Liner in white on a boat deck. This is a 2012 Yamaha 212X. Um, I will be applying Infinity Marine. That's my uh, permanent non-oxidizing clear coat and ceramic coating in one. Um, I'll be removing those decals and we'll just coat the whole boat. But this was the first step and I think it looks incredible. The owner is definitely happy. Uh, he's been a buddy of mine for a long time and this was something we needed to do to straighten this boat out. Those mats were all yucky looking. Um, I'm all about those tight lines. Makes the back of the boat look a lot bigger too, having this liner on here. All right, guys, thank you so much for spending the day with me detailing, well, not detailing, I'm not detailing today. Uh, spraying some Infinity Liner in this boat. Removing the mats was a huge pain in the butt. Uh, masking is always a huge pain in the butt, but the Infinity Liner portion happens like that. So we've spent all day long working on this thing. It's finally done, it looks amazing. I'm super happy with it. If you would like something lined, um, this is a marine grade 2K urethane uh, liner material that we manufacture called Infinity Liner. Uh, Infinity Liner should outlast this boat with no problem at all. Um, if you were to have me line something and there was an issue, we can always do touch-ups. Um, but really, you'd have to be really hard on it to even need a touch-up. Uh, but it is tenable to any color. We do bed liners, truck bed liners, obviously boats, full boats, hulls, bellies, decks, uh, sea dews, PWCs, wave runners, whatever you want to call them. Uh, we do those, the bellies, the top. Uh, we could do 4x4 truck parts, uh, wheels, full-on paint jobs in any color your heart can imagine. Um, but boats as well. Um, this is a very strong marine grade product. Like I've mentioned already, um, I love doing these installs and it looks amazing. Check out Gary Dean's Detail Juice Nation. It's a group on Facebook where we talk about all my products, my processes and what I got going on. Uh, if you need me for anything, my cell phone number is 813-846-4406. Um, and that's it. I can't help you if you don't use the number. Check me out on Instagram. It's gary.dean.35. I'll put that right here. Uh, and thank you guys again for taking the time to listen to me babble. Uh, give me an opportunity to earn your business. If you want some of the best detailing products on the planet, of course I would say that, and so would many, many other people. Check out detailjuice.com. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate your time. Have a great day.